In this video let's take a look at how to add a third person controller. We've looked at the first person control previously so let's try to add a third person controller and see what the difference in these two are. So here we have the first person controller. I'm gonna remove it first and I'm also gonna remove the main camera. We don't need those uh, two. Uh, then what we are gonna do is under the standard assets that we brought in previously we should have a third person character here and under that I, ha I should have a third person under the third person character there should be a folder called prefabs and there should be a third person controller prefab available so I'm just going to drag and drop it on here and you see this this person pops in and uh, since our model is not to scale I'm just going to scale it up just a bit so that we can see this person properly then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add uh, a camera so the camera I'm just gonna bring it under well I need to put it inside of the third person because uh, how unity works is the the first hierarchy is gonna be this this point so these are all at the first hierarchy and this the camera I just dragged and dropped it inside of this uh, the main thing so that becomes a child of this parent so that's how unity basically works and I have this camera and you can see here the camera preview of uh, what I would see when I'm using the camera so I'm, I'm going to move the camera just a bit because I want to see this uh, this person moving and I can also go to the plan view here just to make it uh, a little bit more accurate there you go and uh, there you go like that so this is what I'm going to see. Let's see how that works. I'm going to click on play and there we are. We have uh, this person uh, I think he's called Ethan so we can move around this environment and you can uh, I'm using my uh, arrow keys on my keyboard he's running pretty fast so I'm gonna just so the amount of uh, press dis, uh, defines how much he uh, turns around so I'm just pressing my arrow keys there you go. that's your third person control if you want to add a th third person control that's how you add them uh, you can also bring in a third person control from outside like from the asset store if you don't want this uh, this kind of person I mean you can bring in a realistic person inside of unity uh, if you wanted to, 